Wow. So, lead generation, down something else. That is right there. So, let's talk about it. So, tonight, uh, I came across a thing that said Disney Peter Pan Dumbo. Or you could say Disney Dumbo Peter Pan. And I'm like, why is that trending? Okay, back on the news. On the internet that was trending, so I click on it, and it had to do with Disney Plus, and I was like, I said to myself, okay, uh, it probably be, they're probably going to make a sequel of Dumbo or Peter Pan or making live action, because that's what they're doing now, making a lot of live action. Jeff for cat grab, they don't care if they butcher it. They already butchered Dumbo in live action, in my opinion. They care for that garbage. They butchered the, the they butchered the um they butchered the classic uh Dumbo in my opinion. The original Dumbo was was a classic. Uh grew up with it. Um but I Click it and give me a bunch of when I click click it the news that was trending about Denny Dumbo Peter Pan a lot of headlines and one of them said Denny put remove asset to classic like Dumbo Peter Pan for kids under seven over racist stereotype. Oh my goodness. Disney Plus have shot themselves in the foot. Or you might say, put the, put the foot in their mouth. A lot of people are going to read this. Get so mad that they might um, unsubscribe to Disney Plus, not be a part of Disney Plus no more. Okay, um, a lot of people were mad when when uh, that girl, when that girl uh, from uh, Mandalorian got fired. And that was stupid. Disney Plus. Uh, I, I should say Disney that I grew up with, the Disney that I grew up with from my childhood, and not the thing Disney that I, that I know from my childhood. Okay? It's dead. But Disney nowadays, all we want to do, it, it, it wants to be a mega company. And be a rich mega company. Okay, they don't care about um, making classic movies, good movies. They don't even care if it's virtually old movie like they're doing with the live action movie. Um, now, let's read the article, okay? Then you probably move after to classic like Dumbo, Peter Pan. Kid under seven over rated stereotype. So that's the headline. Before I get into the article and read it, this generation is so weak, so sensitive. They find anything racist. When I was going, when I was uh, uh, going to junior high, and high school. I kept hearing people say, oh, that racist, but that gay. Oh, man. Okay, um, we only know about what they did with the, they, they said, Andromani, 
the classic, you know, uh, pancake dirt, erases. And then Dr. Duke erases. And then the logo for um, Amazon, like Hitler. Come on. I'm surprised. I'm surprised that um, they haven't tried to ban or say, or say every movie that have black people in it could kill the racist. Hey, I'll tell you what racist, what like a week or two ago, what Coke did, Coca-Cola did, it was racist. What they, what they try to do get white people, that was racist. So, um, so now let's get in to um, uh, the article and, and read it. Now I read uh, part of it, but I'm gonna read the whole thing and, and give you uh, until you know what, what what it's about. Okay. Disney Plus has removed assets to classic movie like Dumbo and Peter Pan from menu for children under 7 years old because of racist stereotypes. Those over 7 will still have access to the movie, which includes 1950, Twitch Family Robinson, The Autic Cat, From the 1970s, the New York Post uh, reported the popular streaming service put content warning on the movie last fall that read these serials were wrong then and are wrong now rather than remove the content. We want to acknowledge its harmful impact, learn from it, and fight competition to create a more inclusive future together. The movie won't come up on young children profile on Disney Plus, but parents will be able to show the film to their kids from their own profile. If they choose the, the post reported, Dumbo made in 1941, feature a group of crows who pay homage to Rated Mitchell show where white perform Former with whiteness fade and tailored clothing imitate and ridicule enslaved African, the lad crow is named Jim Crow, which was a law that enforced delegated in part of the U.S. until the civil rights movement. Peter Pan, 1953, includes a diary radical stereotype of native people, including a song called What Made the Red Man. Red. Trip Family Robertson reinforced otherness, otherness by portraying a barbaric pirate who cat a family and a stereotype foreign menace with many of the pirates in brown and yellow face. And the and the orthodox uh, cat assignment Cat named Shun Gone is voiced in bad English by a white actor played the piano, chopped it in aggressive, serial type like, like slanted eye and butt teeth. And butt teeth. Uh, So I guess um, I'm racist because I have the movie that they say racist and they want to remove them from Disney Plus and I have them on my D uh, DVD and VHS tape. Frippin' Robinson, Dumbo, the Oyster 
cat, Peter Pan, Dumbo. Like I said, um, to me, in my opinion, I think people that they they think they're racing. I find anything these things racing or the one that are being racing. Like I told you, when I was when I was going to junior high high school, I kept hearing people say, Oh that gang, that racing. Um I'm surprised they haven't they haven't um banned um uh, any uh or uh Either stay or ban every movie that have black people killing it. That's just dumb, stupid. And to me, this is a stupid thing, a stupid move on uh, Disney Plus part. Because, let's be clear. When I first read it, like an hour ago before the, I drew the video, I thought it, it, it said, before I read deeper into the article, I thought it said they were going to remove it completely. And then I was like, that's totally stupid. You know, they need, they need to get stupid and stupid every day. Okay? They need, and not the Denny that I grew up with. Denny is gonna become a a powerhouse company. That's that's all they want. That's all they are. And not the Denny back in the old day, the good old day. Okay, Denny that I grew up with is dead, dead. Okay, dead. All they want to do is go around buying company. All they want to do is buy company, and they don't care about that company. They just they just shut it down, and, and people just lose their job. Look what they did with Brute. Um, Brew Guy Studio. Okay. Um. Um. And I imagine a lot of people don't even know that uh, Walt Disney was the guy man. Hey, okay. imagine uh, what he see what what Disney doing today. He'll be turning in his grave. Okay. Now, I do. Uh, this is one. This is uh, one of the main reasons why I don't like Freeman Turner. Never for a long time, I never had Freeman Turner. Cause when you have Freeman Turner, in my opinion. You don't have control over your movie and a TV show. Now, some people might say, well, if you don't have streaming service, you're dumb and stupid. For me, I'm not, I don't feel that way. I think it's the other way around because, because, because the streaming service have the people, the, the, the owner of the streaming service ha have more control over the movie and the TV show than you do. Now let me explain let me explain that for a second. Um whatever streaming streaming service you have you you subscribe to we know there are like a, a hundred of them out there. There are too many of them. Whether wherever it's Amazon Prime, Netflix Hulu, Paramount Plus, APO Matt, so on and so forth. Um, and, w and when you watch a movie on there or a TV show, we don't know how long I'm, we don't know how long I'll be on there. And um, they might leave that movie or that TV show on there for a couple weeks, a couple months, a couple years. Who knows? And then they take it all, and it might never come back. It might come back, come back like a year or two. Who knows? That's why 
uh, uh, that's why I always hold line like buying movies and TV show physically okay so um, hey they can plan they can take they can take uh, they can take uh, they can take um, they can take uh they stuff off the uh Disney Plus Dumbo Fit Family Robinson the Ultra Cat Peter Pan But it, it won't bother me. But I think it's dumb but 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 to me I and I can I can sit back and say hey uh, you won't you won't stop me from watching it because I I I have it now and I can watch it all the time and I can uh, uh, review it for y'all on my channel um um now um here's the thing. Um, I got something. I got something wrong ago. I want. I want to. Uh, I got something wrong ago. I want to uh, continue on and touch upon. A while ago, I said. While ago, I said um, that when I when I first read it, the article, I thought it. I thought it said that they're gonna take away. The movie completely, but then when I read again, only with people, the, the children, the kids, the seven years and under. I'm like, I'm like, that is totally dumb. Cause you know, kids seven and under not going to know. That thing movie don't rate That thing is How dumb is that? They worry about things, then they worry about violent sex and drugs. This is a dumb thing ever. And, um, imagine by what they're doing. Is um, uh, what Denny Putt had done, why he hurt himself in the foot, chopped himself in the foot, put his foot in the mouth, wherever it's fucking you want to use, and they probably lost, uh, probably lost a lot of the dragon. A lot of people with the diet from reading that news. And the news about uh, a couple weeks ago, whenever it was, a month ago, whenever it was, about the um, the lady from Mandalorian got fired. It did news and that news, those two news, made you mad and uh, not want to be part of Disney Plus no more. I don't blame you, because the Disney that I grew up, that I grew up. Watching my childhood, it's dead. The Disney I grew up with were like Old Yeller, Herbie, um, Dumbo, Bambi, Snow White, and the Thumb Door. And now, all they want to do is be a big, uh, rich, Money making powerhouse company and make a live action movie uh, of the old classic Walt Disney movie and and also go around buying other other companies. The dumb.
and and I think to this the this generation is not educated, not educated, not educated at all. I don't think Dumbo is racist. He's a lot better than the live action. The live action was power garbage. Trick Family Robinson, classic. One of my favorite when I was a little kid. I, and every time I watch it here and there, I don't find it racist. Dumb, dumb, dumb. Now, the only reason why I still have Disney Plus is because when they when they announced at the YouTube go whenever it was when they're going they're gonna come out with the Obi Wan the Obi Wan Kenobi theory and Hayden Christian coming back coming coming back. That's the only reason why I have it. And I wasn't too big excited. I wasn't too big excited for all the um, the MCU shows. Yeah, yeah. Of course, I'm. Of course, I'm gonna watch all the MCU shows that come on Disney Plus. But the main one, the main reason why I got Disney Plus is for the Obi Wan Kenobi theory. Cause I, cause I like Edgar McGregor and Obi Wan Kenobi. In the prequel Star Wars movie, okay, without a doubt, and that's the reason why I got Disney Plus, okay. And all the all of the um, the movie that it put or take off on Disney Plus that they that they raped it. I grew up watching them in my childhood, and I got them on DVD. Okay. Okay. So let me know what your thoughts and opinion are in the comment section down below. Um, Demi Plus, they hurt, they shot them up in the front. They, they, they probably gonna piss off a lot of the fans, the subscribers. They didn't, they didn't piss me off. Cause I was, I, I was mad at Disney Plus. I mean, uh, uh, Disney a long time ago. Disney was dead a long time ago. And, and I knew this generation was crazy. And, and, I just, I just wanted like the, I just wanted to think that good classic song. With Grandpa? Tell me about the good old days. And this is not the good old days. This is the nasty days. With everybody saying, oh, that racist, that racist, that racist. No. Dumbo is not racist. The other cat is not racist. Peter Pan is not racist. Dumbo is not racist. Chris Family Robinson and not racist. Real quick, I'll tell you what racist. For well, firing, for firing somebody, for for them when they when when that person is expressing their freedom of speech, and then then. And then they get fired because they were just expressing their freedom of speech. That is racist. Or uh, Coca Cola uh, ha want uh, their employees have a train thing, a train section, and try to be less white. That is racist. Or another one, I, another one I say is um, Disney uh, trying to um, 
make a live action movie. Uh, and um, or be or be classic or uh, doing a classic doing they're doing the live action classic Walt Disney movie. That racing. They have that racing. That's your money grab, cat grab, and they're taking they're taking all their uh, classic uh classic Walt Disney movie. Like Snow White, Bambi, Beauty and the Bee, so on and so forth. And they turn them to live action, and when they get turned to live action, they butcher them. And, all, and they don't care if the movie's good or bad, they just care about making money. And they don't, and, and to me, that racist. Another thing racist, in my opinion, is um, they, they buy a company. And um, they shut down the company, and everyone and and they all the people in that company lose their job, and that and that and that relates to the Blue Sky Studio story. Yeah. So, let me know what you thought and opinion on, and let me know if you think the movies are racist. In my opinion, I don't think they're racist. I just think uh, Disney Plus just hurt themselves and probably are going to lose a bunch of subscribers. Um, but I grew up with these movies in my childhood. Um, and um, like I said, the only reason why I have Disney Plus because when they now they they are doing a, a Obi Wan Kenobi theory and uh, uh, Hugh McGregor coming back and at, at Obi Wan Kenobi and Hayden Christian coming back, I got excited. That's the only reason why I got it, and the only couple. Uh, MCU show that I'm excited for, and that's another reason why I got Disney Plus. But other than that, I don't even care about Disney Plus. Hey, most of most of the uh, the, the movie the the, the show I have on I have them. I'm talking I'm talking about the classic one, like you know, like all these that they that they want to take off. I have them on the VHS and the DVD. So, I have control over them. Okay? So, um, you let me know. If, if you let me know, um, if this story makes you mad, or, or if you're upset about it, or if this story, if it, if it, if it's the kind of story that will make you undescribed, to give me pride, and um, do you think, and do, and do you agree with me that this, this generation uh, too uh, sensitive, that, that they will find anything racist, and uh, what story, do, do you have any, anything recently that you know of that, that you think is racist, and uh, let me know that in the comment section below. And um, um, and reach my channel hit the like button and subscribe. Thank you.